As a child, I hated the words, I'm doing this because I love you. Why? Because my dad wasn't referring to giving me candy or letting me stay up extra late to watch a movie. My dad only used this phrase in the moments leading up to punish me. Really, Dad? How are you loving me by punishing me? Although human parents often punish their children for the wrong reasons and with the wrong methods, the author of Proverbs suggests God disciplines us for our good. In Proverbs 3 and 11 it says, My son or daughter, do not despise the Lord's discipline or be weary of his reproof. For the Lord reproves him whom he loves and whom he delights. God loves us too much to let the unpleasantness of discipline get in the way of what's best for us. And God uses discipline to lead us to a more full and abundant life in Him. This doesn't mean that when bad things happen, God is causing bad things to teach us something, especially because God can also use good things to shape our behavior and character and inspire us to become who He wants us to be. Some of the best teachers God uses to shape us are the built-in consequences of making the wrong choices. Yet even in these situations, God often guides us and helps us after we make a mistake. Because God delights in you, He will make every effort to remove self-destructive behavior. Sometimes that might be painful, sometimes it might be uncomfortable, but it's always because He loves you.